been ghosted? Have I been? I must have been ghosted. Gables, no, who would ghost you? No, I think I've been ghosted, guys. Who in their right mind would I ghost know. Gail? I promise you. Whoever you are, <laughs> you need to answer for your crimes, okay? Hey y'all, welcome to the B Word. It's me, your girl B, Bokan, for those of you who don't know. And guys, do we not have an extra special episode of Girl Chat today? Because I'm joined by none other than the cast of, you know, this, this little show, I don't know, you might have heard of it on Netflix called Blood and Water. <laughs> Let's meet the girls. What's up everyone? How are you guys doing? My name is Ahmad Amada and I play Bulin Kumalo on Blood and Water. Hi, my name is Korsin Gemma and I play Figile on Blood and Water. Hi, I'm Gail Mabalane and I play the character of Tanteka Kumalo on Blood and Water. Now in true girl chat form, guys, we're gonna talk about it all. From love and dating. Situationship is weird. It's a buffet situation. Yeah. You want to have chicken, beef, and, and fish and everything in between. And a roti and everything. Yeah, but you yeah. actually like chicken. Well, it's just like being boys, man. man. I really feel like we should start like a situationship anonymous where <laughs> we have you been S-A. in the <laughs> So of course, you know, we're gonna to touch on friendships. What are some signs of a toxic friendship? Oh, Ooh, toxic. I see some friendships and I see how people talk to each other. I'm like, I can't even imagine being in a friendship where we're just doing it for looks. No, no, no. And we wrap things up with a little quiz that y'all gonna have to stay tuned for because it's so cute. This girl hustles, hey? Yeah, yeah this girl is the one. But make sure, it, make sure it comes with a get out of jail free card. <laughs> <laughs> and I guess now there's only one thing left for you to do. And that's sit back, relax, and enjoy! Have you or your character ever been ghosted? <laughs> Is it ever okay to ghost someone? Firstly, it's never okay to ghost someone. <laughs> I'm yeah. saying this to myself too because because we need to hear it. We need to hear it too. I don't think I've been ghosted, child. Like mm. you ghost, We're and I and I do, and it's actually like a bad thing. I think it's because like it's like maturity. Like you're not able to communicate that yo, I need space. Yo, I need distance. It's just hope they won't notice. It's just, just sort of like disappear. disappear. And sometimes you didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, I was just going through something and I couldn't communicate. That. Yes, I've been ghosted. I've been ghosted and you know what when I actually thought about it I was like this is a good thing because it shows me something very important about that person exactly. and it's that he does not have taste I think I've been ghosted have I, been? I must have been ghosted Gables no who would ghost you no I think I've been ghosted guys who in their right mind I ghost know. Gail I promise you whoever you are you need to answer <laughs> for your crimes okay and you'd think as someone who's had experience being ghosted I would not ghost but sometimes it just happens. Yeah. Happens. No, but some people also deserve ghosting, let's mm-hmm. be honest. Like, okay. no, like sometimes, you know, for your own peace of mind and for your mental health, mm-hmm. you like, people must be ghosted. Mm-hmm. If you can't tell the person like, hey, I don't want to be with you. And they're yes. crazy. Yes, yes, literally. Then it's probably better to just disappear. Because also ghosting doesn't necessarily only come from a relationship. A relationship. Okay. You can be ghosted in by, friendship. in friendships, mm-hmm. you can be ghosted, you know, with business. Mm-hmm. But I think I have been, back you know when i was in the you know dating mm-hmm. i think i had i have been ghosted like he stopped replying to your messages yes oh and I, my god i think it must have been something i said or because i think i'm also quite strong mm-hmm. you know my personality is quite strong in relationships so i express myself mm-hmm. um and then you know he some like, people just they were like i this one <laughs> This Kimberly Diamond, I can't. He's like, no way. I was ghosted. Oh, my character has definitely been ghosted though. Girl, your character's been ghosted. ghosted yeah, I saw it end of season and two. She, yeah, I know. She's, she's, but like, she literally got ghosted like in real life. Like, yeah. Yeah. I don't think Buleng has been ghosted. I think she does the ghosting. Has KB never ghosted her? No. Mm-hmm. Season two, mm-hmm. what when happened? he was rapping and he had a whole song before that, did he not ghost? So he broke up with her because she was ghosting him because uh-huh. she kept disappearing, okay. like with Wade, and he's like, what's going on? Uh-huh. Like, what, you know, so they broke up, he dumped uh-huh. her, but he didn't ghost her. Buleng is her mother's daughter because I think Tandaka really ghosted uh, Fiile or, or Pume's dad, mm-hmm. you know, where it was like, he left and she was like, I'm back with my person. Mm. And even, you know, her carrying the child mm. and never really Tell being, yeah. yeah. So you, yeah, really proud um, of you. Proud proud. Of you. Mm. Keep going. City girls are up, okay, <laughs> it's generational. <laughs> 
What are some signs of a toxic friendship? Oh, Ooh, toxic. I think jealousy, not being supportive, and just like little mean remarks. People who compete, I would say. Like, that's a good one. That's a good one. Competing with your friend, like yeah. low key, just like. Oh, that's such a good one. <laughs> like, you know, your friends make jokes at your expense, like in front of mm. people. Like, friends who just always try to bring you down in front mm. of people. Because obviously, in relationships, whether it's romantic or friendships, there's going to be disagreements. So, how does the person treat you even when you're fighting? Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Like, is there still some sense of compassion and still love? Right. So with that person, I saw them actually use things that I confided with them against, against me. You. And I was and like, no. oh, no, whoa. Not, not and that was a huge red flag because I was like, oh my gosh. I could literally do the exact same thing, but because I care about you, even in this moment where we're butting heads, I'm right. not going to do that. My love language is acts of service. Mm. So I'm like... I just want to do like what do you yeah. need okay i'll go i'll go get this i'll drive there yeah. and oftentimes it's not reciprocated yeah. and it could just be that you know it's not their love language yeah. you know um but when you are always the one going out of your way mm. for your friends and and they not mm. for me that is not healthy yeah. i want to be able to know that um listen um do you mind taking Zoe for ice cream? Mm. You know, but if I'm always the one that's on taking the, your kid, yeah, yeah, or just anything that's yeah. doing, that's that's maintaining the friendship, that's reaching out, that's mm. calling, that like, how are you? You know, yeah. like it needs to be reciprocated. I think that it's safe and it's healthy. <laughs> <laughs> Gail, oh Yo, my gosh. Help. What do you do if you can't get over a situation ship? A situation ship is when you guys are not exclusive. Oh. Um, but you're kind of dating. Okay. And like it's not official. Okay. Um, but there's real feelings there. Have you ever been in a situation ship? Have you ever dabbled in experience in the what are we? Yes. Will they, won't they? Yes. But I exited the situation ship. Yes. Because it became more defined. I think it's a very much a now generation thing. Okay. Uh, because I, w I would imagine that, you know, if you are not exclusive, mm -hmm. um, it's normally because you don't want, want it, yeah. you know? But to want it and then not make it official is just... It's a waste of time. No, but it's also just greed. I'm a person, I like clarity. Yeah. I'm like, are we this, are we that? So situationships, nobody really knows where they stand. Yeah. And maybe they were happy with that, but I didn't because it made me feel a little bit insecure as well. And it's like, do you like me? Or like, but like you also want to see other people. Yeah. You want to, you know, it's a buffet situation. Yeah. You want to have chicken, beef, and, and fish and everything in between. And a roti and everything. Yeah, but you yeah. actually like chicken. Yeah. So why, why are you... You want prawns as well. Yeah, no, I don't get that. Situationship is weird. Okay. I haven't really dated that much. Like I, yeah. I've only been in like one relationship before this. Yeah. And uh, yeah, dating really showed me some things. Flames <laughs> a little bit. I think when there's a situation ship, mm -hmm. someone always feels more than the next. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's ever like both both are like I don't you know, there's yeah. always one who's like, yeah, but yeah. You know, so I think it's always gonna it's not gonna it's gonna end in tears eventually it always for someone. Ends in tears, yeah. And then how do you get over it? If you're anything like me, I'm like such a romanticizer. Yeah. So I will look back on something and like either only remember the good parts or even sometimes True. remember it better than it actually True. was. True. So I'd say if you can't get over it, get real with yourself. Do a pros and cons list. What did you like? What did you not like? Mm -hmm. And then actually be like, it ended for a reason. And focus on what you didn't like. Focus on what you didn't like. Yes. And that'll help you just get a little perspective. Yeah. I really feel like we should start like a situation ship anonymous where <laughs> we have you been <laughs> 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 What's a great lesson you've learned from a friendship? That, you know, it's important to create friendships that you can be yourself in, mm. that you can be authentic in. Especially in our industry, we meet a lot of people, we meet a lot of new people, we mm -hmm. make new friends, we, we come on set and there's new cast members and you build relationships with them. But my day ones, mm. you I can just be me. I'm, mm. I'm like the Gail they knew before. Mm. Um, and I think it's such a safe space mm. to be able to have that because I never feel like I have to put it on. Yeah, to just show up for people. Ah, uh, yeah. Come on, girl. Mm. Yeah, just like show up for your friends. Um, people have like different love languages. Yeah. I'm learning this also. Like I'm someone who can, I can love people from afar. 
and okay. be like, hey, let me, let me from a distance. Like every now and then, I'm like, yeah. hey, yeah. you good? Great. You know, Bye. I see some friendships and I see how people talk to each other. I'm like, I can't even imagine being in a friendship where we're just doing it for looks. No, no, no. You know, we're doing it because we want to be, posts. you know, like, no. I don't even think when we get together, we even remember yeah. to take pictures. We don't. It's afterwards, you're like, oh, oh we didn't yeah. even take a picture, yeah. you know? Yeah. Uh, because when we get together, it's that real. It's yeah. like, yo. I need to offload yeah. or I need to talk yeah. or I need to it's not about oh let's 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 yeah. take a picture yeah. for whatever whether it be for social media or anything I mean yeah so that's that's key I think authenticity and yeah. safe spaces can men and women really just be friends this is and I don't know the answer to this <laughs> no I really don't know the answer to this because I think we can of course I really think we can yeah. but then guys say no in my experience there's always been blurred lines a bit, like Ish. they can be. Yeah. Uh, because, I don't know, boys are just, boys just like things. Man. Boys, man. But I've got male friends and it's like, it's it's, it's all good. It like, is good, yeah. Yeah, you know. As long as like in the beginning, it's established like, yo, we're mates. I love that you said that. I, I, I sometimes reach out like, yo, I need help with this. Yeah. Or can you do this? And yeah. you know, um, and they helpful. Yeah. And I never felt like, suspect. If anything, I think we need to push that narrative and have the belief that we actually can be friends. I don't know if they've ever been interested in you, but I think I actually suspect like a lot of them, it yeah. started off as like, oh, and then they realized, oh, you're actually cool. It's necessary for, you know, men specifically to be able to see women just as people outside of what they can get from them. So whether it's yes. like a mothering or a nurturing thing, or whether it's like, you know, relationship or sexuality, yeah. just to see the value of a human being or of a woman as, yeah, just human, whether or not you're gonna get anything from them. And that's why men and women have to be friends. Exactly. The only person that I can say I'm genuinely friends with as a guy, and there's never been from both sides is Savan. And it's okay, so, so weird. she's squashing that. Like, no, but like she's it's squashing so... that right here, right now. She's like, okay. No, but it's so weird because I think everyone would think that. Everyone yes. would think that we would actually be into each other or he's actually the one friend we would like literally just friends. Yeah. Like, yeah. That's it. And I mean, it can happen naturally. Can. Yes. But I think, like you said at the beginning, just be like, very genuine in being like we're actually friends yes. and i'm not here just waiting for my moment exactly yeah it's date night where are you going and with who an outdoor movie night with wade sunset motorcycle ride with sam or chilling in the stew with kb okay yeah yeah just like such a mom i'm always protective of my children yeah, yeah. yeah. this is always a safe option <laughs> and also i mean who wouldn't want to chill and watch a mo an outdoor movie yeah with such a really That's nice yeah, yeah with, with, and i think wade relates to mom and daughter yeah and little brother yeah he just relates to everyone family. you know yeah, yeah. it's like a family a yeah, family family feast i like wade Six, you chose sam i chose sam because Motorbike, sunset. And that's your man. You're gonna stick with Sam. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna stick with mommy. No, <laughs> in the story. Um, yeah, sunset vibes is like it's giving, mm. and I like the throw. Yeah, mm, yeah. I just KB. Um, I don't know. I think being in a studio would just be cool. Like yeah. I really like that experience. Mm. Yeah, to like listen to a song being made. Yeah, and yeah. I don't know about the Netflix and chill afterwards, but, <laughs> but definitely the music. Yeah, like I go, I go to the studio. Yeah, and I'm mm -hmm. yeah. And I've never been to a studio actually. Oh really? Yeah. So I really like that. That'll be a nice experience. Yeah. Any rappers out there? Get up, my uh, <laughs> please don't. <laughs> I won't come. <laughs> <It's so laughs> so Why did you choose Wade? Guys, first of all, Wade is the least red flaggy out of all the guys. <laughs> this is true. Out of all the guys. Yeah, this is true. And yeah, an outdoor cinema date is so cute. It, it is. is. Yeah. Wade is just like so wholesome. So it I feel like we have a good time. I agree. Yeah. 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 I agree. It's December, baby, and time to party. How are you spending your first day of groove? On Chris's yacht party, high tea with Wendy, or an all night rave with Reese? Okay. Oh child, I want to be on a yacht in Dubai. <laughs> in, in Dubai, a thaw, right? please. I've suffered for nineteen years. <laughs> yes, I'm, I'm on Did the we yacht. Did we all say the yacht? Guys, are we going to the yacht? Okay. Yeah, Reese is just yeah. 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 
Yeah, and he's literally yeah. like, it's they can show up you at any time. So, yeah. yeah. yeah no, sure. You met a cutie last night, but lost their number and only have their name. Which friend are you trusting to find them for you? Willing, Tahira, or Wade? Mikael. The Girl. main character. Play all around. around. Yeah, play all around. Find your lost father. Lady. Lady. Your lost sister. Yay, your lost sister. Now we're not like those kind of shows. Play needs her Listen. own. Agreed. Like, Literally, she's like, the girl. Definitely, she'll get the number and the address. <laughs> hey, and my girl will risk her life, guys. <laughs> what season three is? Bro, no, we're talking hey, about Hey, hey. People find people like, for you, whatever it takes. You need to make a quick buck fast. Who are you going to for help? Chris, Reese, or KB? Child, mm. there's only one hustler on the show. The number one hustler. <laughs> we can't guarantee that the pack will be yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know. This girl hustles, hey? Yeah, Ish. this girl is the one. But make sure it make sure it comes with a get out of jail free card. <laughs> <laughs> make sure, because the hustle will be. I, I actually say Chris. Oh wow, okay. Because he's got all this money. Yeah, and like all you need to do is just ask, yeah. and then he'll give you. And he'll give it to you. And he's very generous. He, he, he is, is very, he is, so he is very generous. So he's very generous. You know what? Actually, yeah. I think Chris as well, because with Reese, I'd have to work for it. Yeah, and, and, and she would yeah. have to work for it. And she would it have to like and work for so it. Like with Chris, it's just privilege. Like he just has. Uh, money. Yeah, you're gonna ask. So I think actually yeah. that's a good answer, Cosi. I'm still gonna stick with my girl because she has a business mindset. I feel she like does. I'll learn a thing or two, yeah. and once we make it out, maybe if we go serve some time, in jail, yeah, we'll like, just stash it out, somewhere. You know, then I can now build the empire. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you know. So yeah. I'm yeah. with you. I'm with you on that one. <laughs> you're in the mood for a new look. Who are you going to for a makeover? Fiile, Lunga, or Zama? Everyone have the answer? Yes. And let's reveal who we choose. I definitely choose Lunga. Lunga. Yeah. I was, that was my second option. Like, okay. for Gail? Yeah. yeah. I'll go with Lunga. Okay. Yeah. I see mm. that. I like Lunga's style. He's giving. Yeah, yeah he's nice. giving. Yeah. Right. Comfort first. Like, right. Fikile, Fikile always looks on point, but you Is she comfortable? Though? You, girl. Yeah. 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 And you probably have to watch what you eat, <laughs> watch how you sit. Yeah. What, yeah. Like, yeah. No. yeah. Comfort first. I'm that mom. But you know, like, she will hook you up. No, she will. This, is, will this, is, true. this, this is true. This is true. Same. Same. That's she why, I, like, I know I get designer here. Listen. Like, mm. the best of the best, mm. you know, yeah. so. No, no one some color braids. From Zama? No. Uh, no. No, 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 no. Zama. <laughs> okay. You see the difference between Zama and, and Lunga? Mm. I think they shop at the same place. Okay. Mm. And like mm. Fidila shops. Yeah. yeah. But they, they can take you to Oriental Plaza. Mm. Yeah. But Zama's is obvious. Yeah. Okay. You know? Whereas <laughs> Lunga is like, <laughs> like, Lunga is like, okay, we're not sure. Is it design? Is it all? Right. Yeah. Zama yeah. from there is like, I got it. You're exposing us. Yeah, no. Shame. You're in need of some relationship advice. Which parent would you turn to? Tandeka, Principal Daniels, or Matla? And answers up. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. yeah, definitely. Yeah. She's had experience. Yeah, exactly. That's true. She this knows true. these things. She's been there. True. This is true. Uh, true. Principal Daniels doesn't even is not even in a relationship. What advice <laughs> like, is she giving? She's not. Yeah, you know what? Where is Mr. Daniels? I don't know. They, they, season four, maybe, but she is married. Tendaga was my first option as well, but then I was like, you know what? Masses since episode one of season one, she's been going through it. Let me not. Go but relationship anymore. though, what what like Principal like, Daniels? I chose her because. Okay, no, by the time this video comes out, the season will be out. But yeah. there was this scene with Wade, where he was in his room, and you know, he was doing what boys yeah. do. Yeah. And I just, the way she spoke to him, it was an open thing. She didn't like embarrass him. And she was just almost like, listen, you know, if we need yeah. to talk, let's talk about these things. It's natural. So I was yeah. like, okay, Daddy, mm, yeah. I can come to I also you. like that. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. As a mother. Relationship though. This is hey, girl. Tell you girl. girl. She she tell you from experience. From experience. Yes. She's had her moments moments you know of being there with with yeah listen <laughs> like her daughter yeah juggling between two she you knows know. she knows exactly so i i definitely would go I'll also go you get into a fight who do you trust to have your back wade longa or Pule? and reveal <laughs> Okay. Oh wow! Okay, so maybe I'm the first one. Yeah, yeah. I 
definitely think so. If you need someone to throw the punches, that's Wade. true. Yeah. Mm. And what I like about Wade is even if you're not on speaking terms, mm. he honors so, the friendship, mm. he mm. honors the relationship. Yeah. yeah. I'll fight for you, even yeah. though afterwards he's like, you know what? I didn't like one, two, three, and we don't have to be friends anymore. True. But he'll protect you. Because Wade is so wholesome. Yeah, he's Wade is the best person. Like he is. Yes. Well. He deserves like the world. Yeah, yeah. Bullying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm like Bulling. Bulling. So nice Bulling. Bulling. Why did we choose her? Actually, I, like, why did we choose Bulling? Bulling. No, actually, let me defend mine. The reason I chose Bulling mm-hmm. in a fight because it was like a rumble. Bulane has hands, guys. She she's like, like she literally is on site. Like yeah. she fought that girl at the school. But I think she does it mostly to her benefit. Like she only fights for herself. I don't know if she necessarily fights for her friends. But she can fight. I think she would fight for her friends. Like be there at the back, like and someone's like square up, she'd be like, she'd go. Oh, in. there's actually a scene in season, yeah. in season four where she does like stand up. Oh. Season four. four. Yo. <laughs> I was like, what, what is going on? We started filming already. Oh, you know? What? Season three. Yeah, this is an exclusive. Actually, guys, I'm sorry. I didn't cost you guys. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. The so one woman show. Secret out. The so one yeah, woman show. Just went off with just yeah. playing. I'm so sorry, you guys. Oh, I'm so sorry. Wow. I thought I told you guys. No, um, for season three, um, like she she does like she stood up for Wade in like a scene when Chris was making fun of him and she was like mm-hmm. oh that's true yeah, yeah. yeah. So and, she, and all those girls which girls in the place do you get what I'm saying yeah, yeah. yeah. oh yeah, yeah. yeah. that's true yeah. so Bling yeah. all I can say is Bling has never stood up for her mother yeah <laughs> that's true it's just fight instead she fights against it's just fight all the way all oh. the way she'll yeah, fight so for everyone but her, her mother, mother. Because her mother deep. reminds her so much of herself. True. Mm. True. So I'm looking forward to the maybe being cast in season four. Season four. Of we'll your see. one more show. Sure. We'll get a call. <laughs> oh, guys, and just like that, the episode has come to an end. I know how tragic, but there is some good news. If you want to see more of our lovely ladies, you can catch them on Blood and Water season three, now streaming on Netflix. Ah, darling, didn't that just sound right? Now streaming on Netflix. We love to see it. We love to hear it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Ciao. Yo. Yeah.